Jank little moment. Take on the Zapdos, yeah. Gayu! <laughs> Zapdos, nice. Zapdos has a cool sprite. <laughs> so pistol 50, awesome. Cool, let's uh, use a uh, thunder wave on this thing. It hits, awesome. Let's get a thunder shock on this, okay. Maybe we could choose the easiest um, Pokemon we have after this battle. Let's go for the Thunderbolt. Let's hopefully it doesn't faint it though. This is take one by the way. Super effective, awesome. Let's get a Thunder Shock on us. Maybe we want to try a Thunder on it, you know, put up, try to put up some heat. There we go, Thunder hit, awesome. Nice. Drill Pack, okay. So, so far you have Thunder Shock and Drill Pack. That might be the only Pokemon moves you know. Okay, I'm gonna switch out actually. Let's switch to Lavender, because Lavender can resist Thunder Shock at least. And what not, well, Drill Pack might do some damage, but still. Dang it, I walked right into that actually, because uh, that happened, okay. Let's go for the Horn Attack. Oh, Critical Hit, nice, okay, in, in the red zone, nice. Thunder Shock, it doesn't affect the Lavender. Cool, let's use a uh, Hyper Potion on Lavender. Thunder Shock, it doesn't affect Lavender. Good, because Lavender is half ground type. Let's go for an item, let's use an Ultra Ball on this thing. Don't use your Master Ball, okay, use an Ultra Ball. Oh, for, wow, one try. One Ultra Ball, and it caught it. Awesome, I'll take it. Alright, Zapdos was caught. Nice. Oh, that's pretty lucky right there. New Pokemon, new Pokedex data will be added for Zapdos. Because okay, so Zapdos is an electric Pokemon, uh, it's 5 foot 3 inches tall, weighs 116 pounds, it's number it's number 145 in the Pokedex. This legendary bird Pokemon is set to appear when the sky turns dark and lightning showers and lightning showers down. Cool. Let's give it to Zapdos. Okay, yeah. Let's name this let's name this Zapdos Shocker. <laughs> Shocker, I like that. Shocker. Okay, cool. Shocker was transferred to the Bill's PC. Nice. So actually a way we can get out without having to go all the way back is right here, right? Nice. And then we magically pop up the um front of the door, front of the building, power plant, as you should say. Because in Fire and Leaf Green there's a side entry that you just hop over a ledge and then you get back here. That's basically what it leads to for in Fire and Leaf Green. So let's uh go to where do I wanna go next actually? I wanna fly south of I wanna surf south of Pallet Town because uh because, um, that's where the Simba Island is. But let's go to Viridian City, I guess, just to heal up and show our Pokemon. So I'll show it off real quick. Nice. Okay, so yeah, let's, let's, let's heal up our Pokemon first. Cool, okay, after that, um, let's, uh, show off our, let's actually use, let's actually restore, put some of these items we found in the PowerPoint away, in our PC, before we forget, actually, <laughs> so, Team 30 for 25, and then, Team 33, I think that's it after that, yeah, let me just make sure, there we go, nice, now let's go to Bill's PC, uh, let's go deposit, uh, Gamera again, and then withdraw. Shocker. Uh, stats. Okay, so Shocker is still not full healed. <laughs> oh well, thanks for the. Okay, yeah. Shocker is electric flying type. Electric and flying type. Um, and, uh, it's number 245. It's 145 in the Pokedex. Number 145 in the Pokedex, like I said. And its attack is 104. Its defense is 95. Its speed is 120. Its special is 139. That's pretty cool. It only knows Slender Shock and Jewel Pack. Interesting. So yeah, let's actually get withdrawal Gamera though, because we need Gamera to surf fun and stuff and be our trusty little Blastoise. Cool. Gamera's take out, got Gamera, cool. Nice.